Every driver knows the feeling when you see the flashing lights in your rearview mirror, but for first time drivers, it can be even scarier, which is why police in mid Michigan are stepping in to help. Fox 47's Rowan Belogan tells us how police are trying to prevent that feeling of panic. It's a rite of passage, getting behind the wheel for the first time and teaching your child how to drive. <laughs> Jackie Clay wants her 15 year old son to know what to do. It's a privilege, first of all, to be driving. But she also wants him to learn something she can't teach. I'm a parent. I want to know the right way, you know, that my child should, you know, react in a situation if they get pulled over by a police officer. She wants her son and other teens to know how to respond when they see the flashing lights. We want them to know what to do and not just to panic especially after a Michigan teen died during a traffic stop last year. There's a lack of communication and understanding um, for our students in terms of the, the role, the many roles that the police officers actually serve in. So the MSU police are stepping in to help. We want the community to be informed and to be educated on their rights and what they need to do and what officers should be doing. During a traffic stop, police say instead of rushing down to grab your driver's license and insurance, to instead put your hands on the wheels and wait. We can see their hands. They're not reaching for anything. They're not going into their bag. They're not reaching under the seat. And then we know that we're going to be safe. She told me it's crucial to start this conversation with new drivers before they get behind the wheel alone. It's important uh, to teach these type of classes so that our community is safe and we are safe. Hoping to form a better partnership between drivers and police. In Lansing, Rowan Belogan, Fox 47 News. Sergeant Taylor says the most important thing a driver of any age can do if they're pulled over is stay calm.